good after them. This is our new little show called. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Like, first of all, I'm just saying. Some of y'all bitches need to know your place, know your role, stay in your lane. Because if you're the side bitch, you have no business whatsoever. None! Uh uh, none. Checking another bitch. Or by somebody else's bitch. That you fuck. Stay in your motherfucking lane. I'm just saying, no floods, no shit. Oh, I'm just saying, like, I'm just speaking in general. I'm just saying, like. Y'all bitches just get so comfortable, comfortable, comfortable with somebody else's man. Get your own motherfucking man. Damn, how hard is it to get your own man? It's enough dick out there for anybody. It is. Some of y'all just, you know, you just gotta go to the right place. The best thing is that's the church house. It's like, I don't know. But seriously, like, y'all side bitches got everything just misunderstood. Like, y'all done fucked up the game for everybody. Because niggas not even paying for nothing no more. Niggas ain't buying nobody nothing to eat. They not buying the rooms. They not doing shit. Like, they just... Bring the fucking suck and go on about that bitch. Y'all the fuck it up. Y'all the hoes out there. Y'all the fuck it up for everybody. Like, nobody can for anything. You can barely get a 99 cent goddamn chicken nugget from these nuggets. Cause y'all hoes just literally giving this pussy up. Just stank your pussy everywhere. Just flop it, flop it. Just everywhere. But some of y'all need to have some more. Like, seriously. Carry y'all feel better. But you bitch is tired. People is tired. Y'all sleep with they men. Somebody gonna kill y'all. See, I stopped sleeping with folks men a long time ago. But see, when I was sleeping with folks men, I made sure they was broke up. Y'all might have been going through something, but I, I ain't never broke up a happy home. You know, know your place. Don't be calling and texting folks all times of the night and shit. Baby, you bitch you should have a limit. A curfew or something. Or when y'all gonna call y'all, y'all never phone. Like, y'all know this nigga at home with his wife or whatever. Like, it's safe your text to tomorrow when you can get out. Some of y'all bitches gonna curse y'all bold. Y'all are calling this a what? Jerry Supper, bitch. He having trouble with his family. Y'all bitches calling and texting. It's why. Who is that, baby? Who is that? Oh, nobody. That's the job calling. Now that's the bitch. Control your bitches, niggas. Control your bitches. But they don't make wives like they used to. Because now, the side bitches really is in control. Because y'all wives is too soft. Y'all bitches is soft. Bitches post some pictures of y'all man on social media and shit. Then they bang food up with them and shit. And y'all ain't doing shit. You bitches scared? What? What is it? Could be me, bitch. Let me find my man on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat with another bitch. That's gonna be the end for you. I ain't a bitch. Not if I got time for that. And then all the way all these got this diseases and stuff going on. Bitch, y'all don't even care. Just juice is flopping from here to here. Bitch, nigga lay up with you here, then he go to the next bitch, and then go home and lay up with you. I just don't understand. But I'm always to my uh, destination. So I'm gonna let y'all lay down. Let me gather my thoughts of what I'm about to do next. But, uh, would you be mad at somebody if you're their friend and they be like, don't talk to them because they're their friend? What I mean, what? What was you saying earlier? Thought you was no, like, what I was saying was, see, I'm the type of bitch, I have a lot of friends, so if your nigga's a hoe, and me and you friends, and then he hung with one of my other friends or somebody that I, you know, I keep the with, I'm not gonna stop talking to them because of me and you cool. Bitch, that's you and your, you and your man, but y'all need to work that out. Fuck what y'all got going on. Bitch, I have no parts in this. Don't be mad at me. 
Does that make me fake? I don't think so. Cause I mean, that has nothing to do with it. Bitch, you think you're mad. Like, they think you're supposed to get mad at the next bitch because they fucking... Bitch, that's your nigga. Control your nigga. He know what he doing? Shit. But evidently, these bitches like niggas running all over. Bitch, you ain't gonna get to run me over. I'm a child. All they going back and forth. 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 No, bitch. Cause you ain't got nothing for one motherfucking time to fuck up me and bitch, you go. But yeah. One of my friends actually called me fake one day for a little situation like that. I'm not trying to be funny or anything. But called me fake because the dude was going back and forth. I'm still cool with us, but girl, like, I had nothing to do with that. That ain't nothing to do with me. I'm not fake. I talk to everybody. I'm just a popular type of bitch. You know? I don't understand it, though. Y'all, y'all giving these niggas too much leeway. I don't even want a motherfucking nigga to have a face for me. I don't want you to have no Facebook, no Instagram. I don't really want you to have no type of, if I'm fucking with you, I don't want you to have no type of motherfucking social media, period. Because that's where the problem starts at. All these inboxes and these DMs, direct messages, all that. And if I got time, see, I used to go with a different thumb, motherfucker. That bitch didn't know how to do nothing. Didn't know how to work Facebook, didn't do shit. I didn't have to worry about it. Going through that motherfucking phone because the bitch didn't even text me. I'm like, okay, good. I ain't got to do all that. Y'all better start to leave these motherfuckers pages. And then I went through a little certain situation here not, not too long ago. Uh, this girl that I've been knowing for a long time and I've been knowing her girlfriend for a long time. You know, they're lesbians, they claim they they're married or whatever the situation may be. But they're always on Facebook or Which is fine, which is their business. But once you put it on Facebook, it's everybody else's business, right? So they be on there just going back and forth. So, you know, I'm thinking, you know, okay, y'all broke up, y'all just got through going through the club, you know. But that's not my business, I don't care. So I have a homeboy that used to fuck with you know, used to be friends. When I say fuck with, I mean like chop it up, be cool with, you know, chill with, drink with, smoke with, whatever. So the homeboy, which is in prison, says, um, uh, inbox such and such and tell her to write me. And then he's like, you know, inbox my homeboys that we used to hang with, tell them, you know, I'm doing bad, tell everybody to write me. So I'm like, okay. So I inbox the girl, you know, I was like, he said, right here, or whatever. She was like, okay. So next time I motherfucking know, the bitch girlfriend, about four or five days later, she had rolled him back anyway. Now, mind you, if you a married motherfucker and you happy, and another bitch in your inbox say, somebody such and such said, write them, you gonna be like, nah, I'm married. But see, it wasn't even that type of situation. You know what I'm saying? He didn't want to fuck her or nothing. But she ain't friends. So what y'all do for you? He want a ladder or something. He want a ladder and some compass here. That's all he wants. But the girl, if I say, I used to have so much respect for you and this and this and that. And I'm like, hey, okay. So she's like, why you do some shit like that? Have my girl write a motherfucking M.A. I was like, bitch, first of all, hold on, bitch. Hold up. Calm down. Calm down, bitch. She was just going fast. She was like, cause I pull up on anybody. I was like, bitch, I don't give a fuck who you pull up on. As long as you don't pull up on me, cause bitch, I don't care what about your thoughts, your feelings, or none of that. You pull up at 207 West Dallas, bitch, you're not leaving. Unless you're going in the police car or in the ambulance. Cause I'm gonna be still sitting on my couch. Anyway, she was just steady going and going. I'm like, okay, um. I didn't even know y'all was still together, but I did tell the dude. I was like, well, you know, she got a girlfriend now. He was like, shit, I don't care. Tell her to write me, send me some money. I was like, okay. 
But like I said, I still told him that she had a girlfriend, but I really didn't know if they were still together or not. I just told him that just in case, you know. But baby, homegirl was, I was trying to explain it to her. And I gave up my address where she had never been to my house or something. You know what I'm saying? You know where I stay? She was like, what's that address again? You never showed up. Which is fine. But y'all are going to skip You know what I So, um, she never showed up. Bitch, we could have talked about the little situation. She just made it like a big old thing. Like, I was trying to hook her girlfriend up with somebody, a wife up with another little girl. She been knowing that nigga before he, she even knew you. Now, what they had going on in the past, I'm not sure or aware of. But bitches go crazy, child. They get these relationships and stuff. Claim they marry and things. I don't know. Damn. This is crazy, child. But anyway, I'm done because I'm about to pull up to my destination. We should talk about subs and stuff like that.